Hello everyone, this is Grace of GB Maltese and as you can see I have a package in front of me and this package is coming today from a company named FG Normal. They contacted me and asked if I would be interested in sharing some of their products with you guys to see what I thought about them, see what you think about them. Uh, this might be another place you can go check out diamond paintings. So. We're going to get into this and see what we have. There are, I went ahead and cut it open. I have not taken anything out. There are five items in there. So, let's, we'll take a big one and then we'll take a little one. <clears throat> okay. This is the 45 by 85 centimeter. And this is the picture. Very pretty. I have talked about um, when you get these paintings that have a little bit of a border, you can usually take off five centimeters on each side, five to six centimeters. So this is probably going to be more like a um, 40 by 80, which is fine if you have the nice detail. And this is very pretty. This is a big one. Okay, I'm going to raise you up so you can see a little bit of this a little better. Okay, we have a home here. As you can see in here, we've got this. And then it goes down it's like a real pretty little cottage type home and then we have a path coming down this way we have a bridge and we have looks like maybe a goose and some babies down here and then we have little stair steps going down so it is it is quite large so you can find some nice size paintings on some of the different places. I love the way this looks. It's very pretty. I love this fall scenery looking here, but then we have green grass here and then back to a fall looking scene. So it's very lovely. Put you down a little. And I'm going to let you kind of scan over and see. Maybe see it a little bit better. It's very pretty. It's all the way down here. And as you can see, um, there is a, there are 29 colors in this. And we have a legend over here. And we have a legend over on this side also, which is nice, especially when you have bigger paintings that you have that to help you see everything, see what your symbols are. So this is a nice, big, pretty one. Let's look at the drill field. See if you can see everything. For me just kind of glancing at it, I can see everything just fine. It looks great. Of course, you're going to have some areas of nice color blocking, and then, of course, you're going to have some areas of confetti, meaning you're going to be changing colors. Of course, if you have confetti, that means you're going to have some pretty nice detail in the picture. So that looks nice. Looks really great. And I had mentioned doing a video on showing how I iron my canvases now. I, um, this one, they do, the, the wrinkles do come out eventually, but if you want to get it done quicker, you can iron these. The wrinkles are not too bad. They really aren't. They come out easily, and you can lift the cover and smooth it out also with your hand or I do have a um, wallpaper 
waste paper that I use that I'll use with it but I can show you how I iron these I've done a video on that once before but like I said I'm doing it differently now now that I've gotten to know these canvases a little bit better I'm not so afraid of what can happen they're a lot tougher than what you think you just don't want to get paper on them that you can still fix that okay you also get your toolkit so that is really pretty then we have some beautiful colored drill this is a round I'm just going to open this up a little bit and let you look in at the colors they're very nice you see a lot of fall colors in there very lovely as you can see you can see the sparkle has a nice sparkle to the drill very very pretty so that's a very lovely thing things like this you could hang on your doors in your home because of the length it would be it would um, fit very nicely like that so let's go to the next one that that one is so pretty it's hard to take my eyes off of it okay so I'm gonna grab a smaller one this time and let's see what we have okay be careful when you're cutting these that you don't cut the top top of your canvas off I will start it and then finish it off like this and let's see what we have okay I remember picking this one out okay you guys know I like Betty Boop and I loved all the reds in this one isn't that pretty it's got purples and reds and it's got her little puppy dog I have done one of my Betty Boops, I need to do some more. She's so cute. Um, I think I'm probably going to, this is a 30 by 40, which would end up being 25 by 35, approximately. Let's look at these symbols, even though it's smaller. You can see the symbols. Very easy to read. Okay. Um, let's see what types of symbols we have on here. Okay, we've got some letters. And then we have other symbols. Very easy. These are very easy to do. I love this size. This is probably one I will put in my binder type portfolio. And I can decorate the pages all up and have that looking really neat. So I need to, I need to show y'all what I'm going to do with my portfolio. But she is so cute. So cute. Of course, you get your tool kit and all of these. Everything you need to diamond paint are in these kits. When you, if you're just starting out diamond painting, you do not need to have all the different things we show until maybe you find out you're really loving it and you want to try some new things out. Ooh, pretty. Okay, this is browns again. And let's look at the colors. They're pretty. Really nice. Um, I like this maroon color. Really a pretty color. Now, these do not have the DMC code on the bags, but they are on canvas. Oops. There we go. As you can see. So, that makes it easy if you um, keep your drill. Let's go to, let's go to the, to another big one. Let's see. Okay. This is what the big one looks like and this one is also a 45 by 85 so that would be more like a 40 by 80 
the smaller ones are wonderful to do um, in between doing larger ones when you want something done quick and you, you're like I, I want to do something and get finished I need some something done quick that's when you grab the, the small ones oh wow those greens are beautiful in this Okay, you've got a piece of bamboo with the water running out. Ooh, some of my crystals I have purchased are going to look pretty. And these drops. Oh, yeah. So let's go up here. We've got two swans. And we go up and there is the sky and some butterflies. And we have bamboo on the sides. Beautiful. And then we have lotus flowers this is gorgeous this is really pretty i thought this was such a beautiful peaceful scene we all deal with enough strife during the day it's nice to have something peaceful and the other cottage scene was very peaceful also but if you like water scenes like this this is so pretty look at that just beautiful and the pinks in these flowers are beautiful. Just gorgeous. This, I have actually have my shower curtain in my bathroom. Um, has a bamboo with, um, it's green and has the bamboo within the water. So this might go in there. I don't know yet. This is so pretty. Just beautiful. Let me pull you up a little bit and let's take a look. This far away. And again, we have legend on both sides. And the um, drill field looks just as nice as the others. Look at the gorgeous colors in this. They are beautiful. Very, very nice. The greens, those beautiful pinks. That's a beautiful red, deep dark red in there. Really nice. Lots of green. Okay, so let's go to the next one. We've got I'm going to pull this box out because this is a Christmassy one and Christmas is coming up before we know it and now if you want to make decorations or you want to even just give this as a gift to somebody to work on or as a gift, completed gift, this would be fun. Toolkit. Beautiful. You've got your beautiful rhinestones and look at that isn't it cute you've got your, <clears throat> your Santa and um, they have this here and you pull that out there's a plastic piece here that is gonna hold this there are pieces that you pop out and these little bulbs are gonna go through there but these lights that are in here that are on the inside of this go into the bottom of these bulbs and that's how they light up so it's real easy I have done a couple of different lights and they're real easy to do you're just gonna put that bulb in there of course you're gonna put it in the hole first you'll put this bulb in the hole put the little light in for each one and then snap it all back together well, I forgot to put the plastic piece. It's going to go through both the plastic piece and your Santa. So you're going to diamond paint your Santa. It's all sticky with your beautiful rhinestones. And you're going to have a really cute light. All right. Now, um, I would suggest you keep the package tucked under there like they did because that keeps makes it easy to get um, 
these pieces off when you go to work on it. So I'm going to just tuck that back in like this. These are real pretty. Nice and shiny. Really nice. Um, I'll tell you what. Since these are the only rhinestones that I got from this company, let's take a little bit closer look and, and make sure that they look nice. Just a real quick look. Oh, yeah. And then you get some specials. You have little gold be beads here. Okay. And number eight, you have a couple little stars. Then you have these beautiful pieces here. They're very shiny, as you can see. Really pretty. Have a nice shine to them. Very pretty. Okay. So, this is ready to start at any time, and these make fantastic night lights. It takes, um, I believe, two AA batteries. Yeah, two AA batteries go in the back, and you have to furnish your own. It does not come with it, and then you have your light switch back here. Okay, so let's put that back over there, and we have one more to look at. Let's see what we have. Okay, let's cut this open. always so exciting to get in these packages. It's always fun to get your diamond paintings in. <laughs> um, this I thought was so cute. It is a just a little dog. It reminds me of a little chihuahua. But this is called a fancy dog. I believe is what it called. A rich dog. I can't remember what the name of it was. But look, it's got a little collar on. Um, it looks like it might be made out of fur, and then she's wearing pearls. Then we have something right here. I'll be able to tell more once I get working on that, but there's something here. Um, well, here is a picture of the part right there. I'm not sure if we can tell more about it there or not, but there she is. Let me see. Maybe it's a flower. But she is a cutie. Isn't that cute? And then we have the colors. Oh, those are a really pretty color. I, that's, it looks like it's going to be the background. That's gorgeous. Yeah, that's number five. That's going to be the background. That's going to be a really pretty color. Then we have this other color. And then we have all these other beautiful colors. The drills look very nice. They really do. The canvases look good. They have good prices. So you might want to go check it out and see if you find something that you like on there. They have big, one, big uh, canvases, small ones, um, other diamond painting items that you might want to check out, but there we go. She's cute. She's really cute. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm going to have to do her pretty soon. She she brings a smile to my face. And um, I, well, I think we could all use a, use a laugh in our lives. Anyway, um, this is FG Normal. I'll put the link to their store below. And I will put the link to these little items. I think I can find them. Um, but they're just cute as they can be. This is adorable. And then the other big ones. Fabulous. They're really, really pretty. And then if you're ready to get started with some Christmas crafts. There are all kinds. So I'm going to let you go for now. I hope you're having a lovely, blessed 
morning, day, night, evening, whatever time it may be. Take care, you guys. Love you. Bye.